Now we'll talk about parentheses. Parentheses are used to group things together and numbers and variables and operators, addition, subtraction, etc., all those things within parentheses can be thought of as a single quantity. So let's see what this means when we're talking about translating ideas from English into math. Five times the sum of x and y. All right, think about what this means. Five times this, the sum of x and y. We're going to think about the sum of x and y as a single thing, so we do that by putting that in parentheses. So we'll have five times x plus y. That is the sum of x and y, and we have five times that. Let's look at the next example. The product of w and the sum of a and b. This one's very similar. We have w and the sum of a and b, and we have the product of those two things. So that means we need w and the sum of a and b multiplied together. So let's write our w, and then the sum of a and b, we write that as a plus b in parentheses. What this means is w times this, a plus b. Six times the difference of a and b. Well, this is six times a minus b. That's the difference of a and b, a minus b and we have six times that, six times a minus b. So we have these two things multiplied together. The sum of a and b multiplied by the difference of a and b. So we have this thing, the sum of a and b, and this thing, the difference of a and b, and those two things are multiplied together. So that will look like this, a plus b, that's the sum of a and b, a minus b, that's the difference of a and b, and those two are multiplied together, so we have this thing times that thing. And the product of h and 2 less than h, well product means multiply, so we have two things we're multiplying. What two things are those? h and 2 less than h. So let's write that h times 2 less than h is h minus 2. So we have h times h minus 2. And a couple more here. Three more than the product of 5 and t. Okay, three more than, we know we're going to be adding 3, well, adding it to what? To this, the product of 5 and t. So let's write this first. The product of 5 and t, we can just write that as 5 times t, and we have 3 more than that, so we put a plus 3. And then this last one, the sum of twice the width and twice the length. Okay, we want to add, that's what a sum is, and we're adding these two things, twice the width and twice the length. Well, twice the width I could write as 2w, and twice the length I could write as 2l. So that's the sum of twice the width and twice the length.